I'm a geriatrician. A geriatrician is a specialist doctor who takes care of older persons. So I see a lot of old people. To date, my oldest patient was 110. All my patients tell me, and many of them will say, I don't want to grow old. And I tell them, you will, of course, grow old. But what people are telling me is they don't want to grow old disabled. They don't want to grow old with tubes coming out their nose. They don't want to grow old paralyzed. So I tell them, well, then you have to learn to take care of your body. Your body is like a car. Unfortunately, your COE is about 85 years, cannot trade in, cannot change model. You are stuck with what you have. But your, how we get diseases or even get disabled is because of four reasons. The first reason is genetics, what you inherit from your parents. You didn't just inherit the big eyes, you may have inherited the risk of getting diabetes or high cholesterol. So that's genetics. The second one is about lifestyle. Whether you exercise, whether you eat healthy food, whether you smoke, whether you drink too much, that's lifestyle. The third reason is age. Yes, like any car, as you get older, you may get an increased chance of parts wearing out. Of course, the fourth one is fate. Sometimes we do everything right, but we get the illness. So there are four reasons why we would get diseases and disability. But like any car, it's how you take care of the car. If you have good genetics, a family history where everybody lived to 90 years old, then you're very fortunate. You have been blessed with a well-designed, high-performance car. If you have lousy genes or you have a family history of diabetes and cancer and all that, then unfortunately you may have inherited a car that's not so well designed. But it doesn't mean you should just give up because even if you have a not so well designed car, you must take care of it. As the driver, you need to drive safely. And as in any car, send it in for regular servicing. So, because if you don't service your car, even if it's a well-designed, expensive car, it will still break down by the side of the road. So, the good life cooperative model is take care of your car, your body. For the car, it's 40, 60, 80. For your body car, it's 40, 60, 80. At 40, it's when diabetes, high blood pressure and cholesterol become more common. At 60, it's when you start changing parts. So that's where the stents come in, the heart attacks come in, and all these other things. At 80, if your car starts in the morning, never mind if it's got a few scratches, you're very happy. So it's important to take care of your car. As a doctor and as a healthcare professional, I cannot drive the car for you. You are in the driver's seat. You must drive your car yourself. But all of us are coming together to help be your GPS and to guide you along the way.